Hey guys, this is Eitan Levine from Cheddar. What's the most expensive cup of coffee you've ever had? $4, $5, maybe $6? Well, today we're gonna to be trying an $18 cup of coffee at Extraction Lab in Brooklyn. I don't know about you, but I'm ready to get my caffeine fix. Let's go. So my name is Thomas Perez and I am the CEO of Alfa Dominici and of Extraction Lab. As I've been drinking coffee for many years, I'm really intrigued by the whole spectrum of different flavor profiles and how they are being affected by different brew methods and different processing methods. Our $18 coffee is obviously our most precious thing we have on the menu. The one we have right now is a Panama Geisha coffee from 90 plus farms. The whole process is very specific to what they do on this farm. First they're using a Geisha coffee which has a much lower yield than many other types of coffee. The way they pick the cherries is also very different. They only picked ripe cherries, so they have to go back to the same plant up to five or six times. Later on, they have certain fermentation methods that they are processing the coffee with, and at the end of the day, it's a combination of variety, processing methods, and the uniqueness of this coffee that drives up the price. I mean, a whole new experience is waiting for you. It's almost like being in a theater. You're watching the whole brew process from the beginning to the end. You will come in, you will have the selection of different coffees and teas you can pick. You will pick your coffee and tea, and you will go and you will see the barista grinding the coffee for you in front of you. We pour it into the machine. We load water to the machine at the exact temperature. And then we're using steam to push the water from the lower chamber to the top chamber and create turbulence in the water. So at the end, we will open the valve between the two chambers and the water will be pulled back to the lower chamber and the coffee is ready to serve. This coffee has a lot of sweetness, it has floralness, it has a lot of almost, I would say, conflicting profiles of, of flavor from like very sweet to acidity and so forth. If you really want to try something unique in your life, then this coffee is the way to go. Wow. Yeah, it does not taste like regular coffee. Oh wow, that's very fruity. It's very acidic, but like a fruity acidic. There's a fruit flavor that kicks in. It's like a fruity pebbly. You can really uh, taste the fields of Panama in this cup. All right guys, I had the $18 cup of coffee. I'm not gonna lie, I'm feeling super caffeinated. So I'm gonna go, thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and like our Facebook page and our Twitter page and all the other social media stuff. All right, uh, bye.